You mentioned that you have a 17 month old little boy who seems to be sleeping pretty well overall. He's taking two naps in the day, going to bed well, sleeping well through the night, but then waking up really early. So you're wondering when you should combine the two naps and Usually between one and three years of age, a toddler requires anywhere from 10 to 13 hours of sleep. And the amount of time they sleep during the day will depend on how much they're sleeping at night. And so, um, you know, a lot of kids start to take their naps from two to one after their first birthday, some before, some a little bit later. And this is something you can experiment with. Basically, it should happen when you notice that your child is becoming extra fussy or if, it's, or if naps are messing with bedtime. In your case, you're worried about early wakings. If what you're currently doing is working well for you and your child, especially if he's happy during the day, then there may not be any need for adjustments. But if you're wanting to sleep longer, then maybe you can make that happen by adjusting his bedtime a little bit. If he's going to bed really early, he's going to wake up early. Children who go to bed later generally wake up later. Um, but the bedtime is also going to be affected by naps. And so if he's taking two naps and it's too close to bedtime and that's messing with that, you may not be able to adjust his waking time in the morning without, without adjusting naps too. So you could first, I would probably try one thing at a time, try combining naps first and seeing what that does. Since he's waking up really early in the morning, you don't want to put him down till probably after lunch and the morning might be really hard for you. He might be cranky, but give it a try and see what happens. And that afternoon nap can be anywhere from one to three hours and be normal. If you find that that's not working or you just want to try to adjust bedtime first without messing with his naps, you could try adjusting bedtime 15 minutes at a time until he's going to bed at a time that works for you and waking up at a time that works for you both. Um, really, there's, there's no one good formula for all kids and all families. It just kind of depends on what works for you and what works with him. If you have more questions for me in the future, please feel free to ask them on our Facebook page at facebook.com forward slash Intermountain Moms and recommend us to your friends and family too.